we think that it's a huge discovery. When we think about space, especially our own solar system, it's easy to imagine everything that's ever going to be there already being there. The idea of something new popping up just doesn't seem likely because of the way we understand space and how ancient everything is in it. But that's far from the truth. Celestial objects are born in space, but not super frequently. And most of the time, these aren't in our solar system. Everything we know about, everything we can see, me and you, everything on the planet, all the hundreds of billions of other galaxies, all of that only makes up about 5% of the universe. This is why it's shocking that the James Webb Telescope just detected 500 huge objects appearing near us. Join us as we dig deeper into this shocking discovery and how it might just change everything we've ever known about our own solar system. The James Webb Space Telescope is a groundbreaking achievement in the field of space exploration and astronomy. Representing the newest generation of space telescopes, its capabilities surpass those of its predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope. Since it's able to focus on the infrared portion of the electromagnetic spectrum, the JWST has got a unique advantage in studying celestial objects that emit longer wavelengths, thus enabling it to look deeper into the mysteries of the universe. Unlike visible light, infrared radiation can penetrate cosmic dust clouds that often block our view of distant galaxies and cosmic phenomena. If we can't get through the dust clouds, we're not going to get data that's accurate enough to study. By peering through these cosmic veils, the JWST offers an unparalleled perspective on the early universe, revealing its evolution, the formation of galaxies, and shedding light on the cosmic processes that shaped our present-day cosmos. Launched on December 25, 2021, the James Webb Space Telescope is NASA's largest and most powerful space science telescope. Its deployment marks a significant milestone in space exploration as it is equipped with state-of-the-art instruments and technologies capable of revolutionizing our understanding of the cosmos. One of the JWST's key features is its high-resolution and high-sensitivity instruments, which enable it to observe objects that are too old, distant, or faint for the Hubble Space Telescope. By capturing the faintest signals from celestial objects, the JWST can explore the early stages of the universe, study the formation of galaxies, investigate the atmospheres of exoplanets, and unlock the mysteries of dark matter and dark energy. The telescope's primary mirror is a technological marvel. Composed of 18 hexagonal segments made of beryllium coated with a thin layer of gold, the 6.5-meter diameter primary mirror offers a polished area of 26.3 square meters. This large mirror provides exceptional light-gathering capabilities, enabling the JWST to capture detailed and precise observations of celestial objects. Located at the Sun-Earth Lagrange 2 point, Approximately 1.5 million kilometers from Earth, the JWST benefits from a wide view of the cosmos and remains shielded from the Earth's atmosphere. This positioning allows the telescope to escape the interference caused by atmospheric turbulence, enabling clearer and more accurate observations. With its advanced infrared instruments, it can study the atmospheres and compositions of gas giant exoplanets contributing to our understanding of the formation and evolution of planetary systems beyond our own. This telescope was built to push boundaries and get us information that would have been unheard of, even five years ago, and it's doing just that, in a few different ways. Firstly, it aims to transport us back in time, casting its gaze upon the universe's first light. With unparalleled precision, it aims to capture the ethereal glow emanating from ancient galaxies, so we can learn about their formation and evolution. This takes us to history that no one could actually study in the past. The more we learn about the history of the stars and galaxies, the easier it is to focus on what's going to happen in the future. Beyond galaxies, JWST dives headfirst into the captivating realm of star and planetary system formation. It studies the point where stars are born and dissects the dynamics of protoplanetary disks where these stars grow stronger, and armed with its infrared vision, 
JWST scrutinizes the chemical makeup of these cosmic nurseries. It's constantly searching for the vital ingredients of life. Water, organic molecules, and other compounds become the clues that unravel the enigma of our cosmic origins and hint at the potential habitability of distant realms, no matter how far they may be. As JWST explores the genesis of stars and planets, it takes an even bolder leap, the quest to examine exoplanetary systems. It trains its keen eye on distant planetary realms, studying their atmospheres, compositions, and potential for life. Through the delicate analysis of light passing through exoplanet atmospheres, JWST hunts for the signatures of water vapor, carbon dioxide, methane, and other molecules that may unveil the secrets of habitability. This cosmic detective work challenges us to contemplate the existence of other worlds teeming with life, expanding our vision of the universe's potential. But all of that might make you think that this telescope is only to explore the far space but that's not the case. The whole point of placing the telescope at L2 was that it's at the optimal spot to explore whatever it wants to. So, beyond its primary mission objectives, JWST also keeps an eye closer to home. One of the fascinating areas of study within our solar system is the exploration of asteroids and comets. JWST meticulously observes these celestial objects, providing valuable insights into their composition, structure, and dynamics. Analyzing the light emitted and reflected by asteroids and comets helps unveil clues about their origins, evolution, and potential impact risks. These observations contribute to our understanding of the formation and evolution of our solar system, shedding light on the processes that shape the planets, moons, and smaller bodies within it. Considering the fact that our solar system works in a complete balance that must stay in order, every single particle needs to be in its place. So with a telescope like this, we can learn about the intricate movements, and if anything does end up moving out of place, detect those changes immediately. In addition to that, JWST turns its gaze towards the outer planets of our solar system, including gas giants like Jupiter and Saturn, as well as ice giants like Uranus and Neptune. These are the planets that are extremely important to our solar system, but they're so far away from the Earth that we just haven't really been able to study them in depth before. By studying the atmospheres, weather patterns, and cloud formations of these distant giants, the telescope offers a glimpse into the complex dynamics that govern these massive worlds. It provides unprecedented detail and resolution, allowing scientists to deepen their knowledge of planetary physics and atmospheric processes in ways that were unheard of even five years ago. In the quest to unravel the mysteries of the cosmos, JWST also investigates the enigmatic forces of dark matter and dark energy. While it might sound like something out of a movie, dark matter actually outweighs visible matter by a significant margin and is believed to influence the gravitational dynamics of galaxies and shape the large-scale structure of the universe. It's crazy to think about the fact that all this time, we haven't even been able to see what makes up most of our solar system. But JWST contributes to this area of research by observing the gravitational lensing effects caused by the presence of dark matter, helping to map its distribution and understand its role in cosmic evolution. Similarly, dark energy, an elusive force driving the accelerating expansion of the universe, is a topic of great interest in the study of outer space. JWST aids in studying dark energy by observing the most distant supernovae, which serve as cosmic distance markers. These observations allow scientists to measure the expansion rate of the universe over cosmic time, providing crucial data to further refine our understanding of this mysterious force. But it doesn't just stop there. The James Webb Space Telescope also conducts extensive observations of nearby galaxies, providing detailed images and spectral data that enable researchers to study their structure, star formation rates, and evolution. The telescope's ability to capture infrared light allows it to pierce through cosmic dust and reveal the hidden regions within galaxies, unveiling the mechanisms driving their growth and the interactions between stars and gas clouds. Even though it would normally seem a little bit of a stretch to investigate the nearby galaxies when there's so much about our own galaxy that still remains in the dark, 
Every single detail that we can learn about our neighboring galaxies can uncover things we didn't even notice about our own. Everything in place works hand in hand, some in more subtle ways than others. So JWST keeps watchful for transient celestial events, such as supernovae, gamma ray bursts, and other fleeting yet powerful phenomena that occur across the cosmos. Supernovae, the colossal explosions marking the end of a star's life, are among the most dramatic events in the universe. JWST plays a crucial role in capturing the spectral signatures of supernovae, allowing scientists to analyze the emitted light across a broad range of wavelengths. The characteristics of this light, such as its intensity and composition, are studied by researchers to gain insights into the mechanisms underlying these cataclysmic events. They can now investigate the literal nature of the progenitor star, the dynamics of the explosion, and the subsequent dispersal of elements that enrich the surrounding space. Just like that, gamma-ray bursts pose intriguing questions about the most energetic processes in the cosmos. JWST's swift response capabilities enable it to promptly observe these brief and intense bursts of high-energy gamma rays. Since the telescope is capable of capturing the afterglow of a burst across the electromagnetic spectrum, including infrared light, it provides critical data for understanding the nature and origins of these cosmic fireworks. Scientists can probe the environments in which gamma-ray bursts occur, such as massive stellar explosions or the collision of neutron stars, and gain deeper insights into the physics driving these extraordinary events. Beyond supernovae and gamma-ray bursts, the telescope also focuses on transient celestial events that extend to a wide range of energetic phenomena occurring across the universe. This includes events like tidal disruption events, where a star is torn apart by the gravitational pull of a supermassive black hole, or the collisions of neutron stars, which give rise to gravitational waves and emissions across the electromagnetic spectrum. By quickly responding to these events and capturing their spectral signatures, JWST provides crucial data for unraveling the underlying physical processes at work. It helps scientists understand the extreme environments, the energy release mechanisms, and the intricate interplay of matter and forces in these extraordinary events. These explosive events serve as windows into extreme cosmic environments and provide invaluable clues about the physical processes at play. Through its ability to rapidly observe and analyze transient celestial events, JWST acts as a crucial tool for deciphering the mysteries of the universe. By capturing the spectral signatures of supernovae, gamma-ray bursts, and other energetic phenomena, it enables scientists to explore the extreme environments that give rise to these events. Just like that, another extreme event is when objects just appear in our solar system. While we have had visitors like Oumuamu in the past, we've never really seen a sudden increase in hundreds of objects, especially not 500. The objects detected by the telescope are currently unidentified and pose an intriguing mystery to scientists. Despite rigorous observations and analysis, these objects have yet to be definitively classified or categorized. But even then, they represent a fascinating array of celestial entities, ranging from familiar astronomical bodies such as asteroids and comets, to potentially novel and previously unknown objects that have made their way into our solar system. The sheer diversity and quantity of these unidentified objects present an exceptional opportunity for scientific exploration and discovery, but at the same time they could pose a danger too. The significance of the telescope's detection lies in its potential to unravel the formation and evolution of our own solar system. Studying their properties, trajectories, and compositions help scientists gain invaluable insights into the processes that have shaped our cosmic neighborhood over billions of years. Analyzing their physical characteristics, such as their size, shape, and surface features, can provide clues about their origins and evolution. Additionally, by examining their orbital patterns and gravitational interactions, researchers can better understand the complex dynamics that have shaped the arrangement and behavior of objects within our solar system. Beyond our own solar system, the telescope's detection holds implications for understanding the formation and evolution of other solar systems in the universe. With that knowledge in hand, scientists can draw parallels and make comparisons to objects observed in distant star systems.
The detection of these objects also contributes to our understanding of the distribution of matter in the universe. Examining the orbits, locations, and properties of these newfound objects within our solar system is extremely important, so astronomers can refine existing models and theories regarding the large-scale structure of the cosmos. These observations offer valuable insights into how matter is distributed on a cosmic scale, helping to further our understanding of the universe's composition and organization. Intriguingly, the telescope's detection of these objects may provide indirect evidence or constraints on the nature of dark matter, a mysterious substance that makes up a significant portion of the universe's mass. The careful observation of the gravitational interactions and effects of these massive objects on their surroundings is key to gathering clues about the presence and behavior of dark matter. This investigation can contribute to solving the long-standing puzzle of dark matter and help refine our understanding of its properties and role in the universe. Similarly, the detection of these objects holds promise for shedding light on the nature and influence of dark energy, the mysterious force driving the accelerating expansion of space. While the discovery of 500 new objects in our solar system is exciting in and of itself, it also raises questions about their origins. One intriguing theory is that they could have been ejected from a black hole. Black holes, the mysterious cosmic entities which can be formed from the collapse of massive stars, possess such intense gravitational forces that they can disrupt nearby objects and fling them into space. If these objects were indeed expelled from a black hole, it would be a remarkable testament to their immense power and influence of them, which would go beyond just swallowing everything around them. It would mean that they can also spit material out. You see, the intense gravitational tidal forces exerted by a black hole can tear apart stars or planetary bodies, creating a tumultuous environment where debris and fragments are violently ejected. But could it really eject material from within? Let us know what you think in the comments below. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up, and like always, we'll see you in the next one.